celebrating we are celebrating my son's fifth birthday in this episode so so exciting so many things happening friday saturday and sunday what's happening one second hello hey auntie grandy how are ya Hi guys it's saturday day two of this birthday weekend and i am so excited right now i'm so excited um i spent the whole morning i woke up pff, nine o'clock right i woke up nine which is quite late i wanted to be up a lot earlier but i was tired i was knackered i spent the whole first hour just wrong just strolling in bed and trying to figure out why am i doing this i'm so tired and it's like you want to give your son an awesome experience a memorable fifth birthday that is why got motivated got up and just started tidying up the house quick check on my sisters like what time are you guys getting here they said around about two o'clock so it's two now they'll be here any moment which is great because i haven't done the birthday stuff i literally just tidied up the house i haven't done the birthday stuff I'm really eager for them to come and help me with that. Um, so before we move on to that, I want to say another tip. So I want to try and throw in as many tips as possible to uh, living life as a queen conscious woman. Um, and tip number one is that you need to remember to ask for help, right? Overworking yourself, getting yourself exhausted and tired, it is not good. Um, I think I said this yesterday one of the things that I had when I first had my kids when I have all three kids and I was you know running the restaurant business back then when I was uh, married to my ex-husband I had an au pair I had an au pair I remember having an au pair for a good three years and it was so helpful right because I just couldn't do it it's okay to get help this weekend reminded me I need to invest in a cleaner because I spent two hours, over two hours, right? Tidying up this room. And I thought to myself, and I do this every Saturday, right? Every Saturday, I spend at least an hour just cleaning. But to be quite honest, after that, you're exhausted. I would love to just get some help in that area so that I can enjoy my weekends and, you know, rest more because I do often have sessions. I have events like tonight, I'm actually speaking. I have a a clubhouse uh, speaking engagement so yeah invest in help it's okay to help to have help right if you need a cleaner if you need to help someone to help you with ironing like folding those clothes for an hour was just a total nightmare um for me because i haven't got that time so even in the bible the proverbs 31 woman had help she had help because she's running an empire so if you're a womanpreneur like myself and you're trying to build an empire it's okay to get help right it's it's allowed so anyway enough of the rant <laughs> i'm gonna give you guys a quick look on the finish of this room that i managed to tidy up so this is what we basically have i managed to sort out the beds right they're all sorted all the kids the cousins my nieces are coming all of them literally you could have two two kids <laughs> so that this is a good investment right um and then uh, this bit is done uh all done all done this little timetable is so helpful like pe days i literally always forget so i just come here i'm like yes pe today great i'll show you one of my favorite pictures this is one of my favorite pictures. That's Amore on the left who's now in heaven. May she continue to rest in peace. I absolutely love this picture. It was taken um, when I think Junior was about two years old and I absolutely love it. So there, so yeah, so that's all done. The wardrobe, I've got my little African, African outfit today, the African queen vibe and whoops if i can open it like this two hours <laughs> oh, folding is just not my cup of tea get help get help get help get help okay so that's pretty much done 
and um let's move on to the living room hi it's gladness here thank you so much for tuning in to my youtube channel welcome 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 guys thank you so much my guest speakers for helping you is showing you so that when you need something else you can be able to do it yourself because yeah? it says that in verse 28 her husband praises her hi please how are you doing today i have a very special guest my brother Junior. okay and today there's a book coming out queen and least and it's on Amazon right now, so I hope I hope you should get it. So that's all I wanted to talk about. Bye. Bye. All right. So there's still so much to do here. Um, this is the birthday backdrop banner. I absolutely love this. I got this from Amazon. The theme uh, for today is. For the birthday is basically royalty junior loves to be called king junior nowadays <laughs> so we're going with that i even got him this this little crown can you see that it goes with the banner so that's amazing that needs to be put up this is the backdrop for it that needs to be done so like i said i'm gonna wait for my sisters to come there's so many bits and bobs in here Right, these are all ops. These are all literally party stuff, balloons, and all of that stuff needs to go up. Right, this is really not my niche, so I'm gonna wait for my creative sisters to come. Got the cake here from Feed Your Imagination. That's done. Got the food, snacks, but I need to sort out the food. So that is basically it. I am going to go and make something to eat and then carry on with the rest of the day hey guys so it's going down in the kitchen here i have been obviously preparing for um the party tomorrow i don't want to wait and cook everything all in one day because i'll end up spending the whole day in the kitchen so i've done some preparation already today what i can do um which is i've done this leg of lamb and I've done this chicken as well. I just need to stuff the onions in there. And all I use is um, maggi puree, garlic puree, ginger puree. And for the chicken, I added this one as well. Um, so my sisters have been delayed. They're meant to be here at two, but now they're not getting here till five. So. I figured I might as well start with um, making dinner as well because they're gonna be hungry. So I'm making some goat stew. I've already started. This is it, it's all seasoning. Literally just boiling the meat with some onions and some maggi juice in there. I've already blended my tomatoes. Um, so all I need to do is wait for the meat to cook and then just fry it and do the stew and I'm good to go and then once they arrive they're gonna sort out the decoration uh, because the actual surprise is today because my kids have no idea that anybody's coming over that's the whole point then I will go and pick them up round about six seven should we say seven and then enjoy the rest of the evening so so excited my sisters are here hello Yay! Come up, come up, come up! I'm excited! Oh, that's you guys. Oh, I'm excited. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
It's coming together, sisters. Well done. I knew when they get here, they're gonna bring it together. It's coming together. I can't pretty get in your bag. <laughs> oh well done sis this is why i said i am not gonna touch this stuff oh, amazing that is really long so it can actually go as long as you want it yeah as sure as you want it as long as you want it amazing that is really long <laughs> yeah. Wait, no, 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 no. It's as tall as a giraffe, that is. So I've left my sisters putting up the decoration. It's all coming together. I am so excited. I cannot wait to see his little face. He's gonna be so shocked. <sighs> I'm on my way to pick him up now, pick up the kids and then have the first element of the surprise. I cannot wait, so keep tuning in. Tell us how you feel about turning five tomorrow. Excited and happy. What are you looking forward to most about turning five? Um, I know that. Definitely. Um, what are you looking forward to the most? Being good. Being good. Amazing. What else? Um, and being kind. And being kind. Okay. What else? Alana says he, she knows. What do you say, Alana? Yep. Okay. Well, that's really just every birthday people like present, but we're asking, I'm asking, what's exciting about being five? Five is a big number. Got presents. <laughs> now that Alana said that, but that's got nothing to do with your age. You said you were the youngest in your class, isn't it? You said everybody's five, so I thought you'd be excited to be five so that you can be the same age as everybody else in your class. You're not excited about that? <laughs> ah. And what do you think, Junior? What would you like to do when you're big, like when you're 18 years old? Um, what? Drive. Drive. Okay. And make dinner. And make dinner? Oh, you're looking forward to cook? Yeah. Okay, and what else? Um, what else are you looking forward to the most? Do we need to What do you want to be when you grow up? What do you mean? What do you want to be? Do you want to be a doctor? Do you want to do business like mommy? Do you want to play football? Do you want to play basketball? I want to, I want to play football good. You want to play football good? I want to be um, a nice football player. Ooh. And a basketball player. Nice. I don't really like basketball. You don't really like basketball? Yeah, I, I like basketball. But you love football. So you want to be Wait, a footballer have, when you grow up? Do you still have that? Oh, are you just happy about that? Yeah? <laughs> yeah, but I mean look. Oh wow, that's beautiful. So, you want to be a footballer when you grow up? That's yeah. amazing. And then, uh, and then, um, a better football player. You want to be and a... And I can do moves. You? You're gonna do some moves. Yeah. Ah. You wanna do good moves. So you have like to keep practicing. Like daddy. You have to keep practicing then, isn't it? Yeah. So that you can be great. Great footballer. And I'm gonna be like daddy soon. 
Yeah, you're gonna be tall like that, eh? Aren't you? Because I'm already five. Because you're already five and you're already tall, isn't it? Wait, do you know what we're gonna do? Maybe we should measure him today mm -hmm. and then see how tall he is tomorrow. Yeah. Overnight? Okay. We could do that. We could measure you today. And we're really, really home. We're nearly home now. Alright then, let's get home, shall we? You are watching Queen Unleashed TV. UYG is a community interest company providing services to benefit the community. We need your support to carry out our mission in providing personal development, training, courses, counselling, therapy, helping women rise from brokenness to brilliance. Your donation makes a big difference in setting a woman free from trauma, depression, anxiety, domestic abuse, amongst other things. Thank you for supporting UYG.